Welcome to Monterey, California, a charming seaside community on the state's central coast. Monterey is a wildlife tourist attraction for visitors and locals because of its breathtaking natural beauty and extensive history. Everyone may find something to enjoy in Monterey because of the beautiful coastline, varied fauna, and numerous cultural attractions. In this video, we'll look at some of the best things to do in Monterey, including touring historic sites and hiking beautiful trails. Prepare to pack your bags and come along as we explore Monterey's incredible sights and experiences. Wander in Monterey Bay Aquarium. Anyone traveling to the city should visit the Monterey Bay Aquarium. You'll have the opportunity to observe the richness of marine life. Found in Monterey Bay with over 35,000 organisms from over 550 species, you'll be amazed by the fantastic species swimming and floating around you from sea otters to jellyfish. The Monterey Bay Aquarium provides visitors of all ages with an innovative and informative experience with its cutting-edge exhibits and interactive displays. This renowned attraction is guaranteed to captivate and inspire you, whether you've always loved the water or are curious to learn more. Take a stroll in Cannery Row. This neighborhood, formerly home to multiple fish canneries, has become a hive of activity. Cannery Row is the ideal area to spend an afternoon exploring and soaking in the sights and sounds of this dynamic neighborhood because of its lovely street-side restaurants, specific businesses, and welcoming ambience. Everyone can find something to do in Cannery Row, whether shopping at the neighborhood businesses or having a bite to eat. Take a scenic drive along 17 Mile Drive. This drive is a must do for anyone visiting the city and features rolling hills, immaculate beaches, and beautiful coastline vistas. Famous sites like Bird Rock and the Lone Cypress Street are seen as a road through Pacific Grove and Pebble Beach. The 17 Mile Drive is the ideal way to experience the natural splendor of the Monterey Peninsula with its breathtaking scenery and recognizable attractions. Be prepared to discover this hidden gem, the Pacific Grove and the Butterfly Sanctuary. With a focus on the local flora and animals, this modest museum is devoted to displaying the natural history and ecology of the Monterey Bay region. Visitors can discover the region's numerous ecosystems and their vital role in the ocean's overall health in the world. For visitors of all ages, the Pacific Grove Museum of Natural History provides an engaging and educational experience with interactive displays, hands-on exhibits, and educated staff. We are Travel Pug, your travel guide around the world. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button, and hit that notification bell to stay up to date on more videos here on Travel Pug. You wanna wanna miss out on a trip to Monterey Bay Whale Watch. A Monterey Bay Whale Watch is a memorable experience. Monterey Bay is one of the best sites in the world to watch whales in their natural habitat. A whale watch trip in Monterey is a must do for anybody visiting the city because it features expert guides who will impart their knowledge of these majestic creatures. Gray whales can be spotted from the shores of Monterey Bay during their annual migration, which takes place from December to April. But that's not all. For a truly exceptional and unforgettable encounter, you might see humpback, blue and even killer whales. Take a stroll along Fisherman's Wharf. A stroll along Fisherman's Wharf is an excellent opportunity to get a feel for the city's buzzing bustle. Fisherman's Wharf is a foodie's heaven with street sellers, seafood shops, and lovely seafood eateries. Fisherman's Wharf is a must-see. Whether you're in the mood for a filling seafood lunch or just want to take in the sights and sounds of this energetic neighborhood, a walk down Fisherman's Wharf is a memorable experience from the salty sea air to the distant sounds of sea lions barking. Be prepared to transport back in time at the Pacific House Museum and Pacific Grove Arts Center, a historic structure. The Pacific House Museum chronicles the earliest settlers of Pacific Grove. The Pacific Grove Art Center, meanwhile, displays creations by regional artists. Anyone interested in history 
or the arts should visit both of these locations. The Pacific House Museum is a historic building located in the heart of Pacific Grove. Initially built in 1875 as a hotel, this building has a rich and storied history, having served as a hospital, school, and more over the years. Today, the Pacific House Museum serves as a museum showcasing the history and heritage of Pacific Grove and the surrounding area. The Pacific Grove Arts Center is a local gem located in the heart of Pacific Grove. This community-focused arts center offers a variety of exhibitions and classes to visitors, showcasing the talents of local artists and encouraging community involvement in the arts. Play around at Del Monte Golf Course. The Del Monte Golf Course is a storied golf course, centrally located in Monterey. The oldest continually functioning golf course in California was opened in 1897 and is regarded as one of the best in the state. The Del Monte Golf Course offers a distinctive and challenging experience for players of all ability levels with its beautiful vistas off the Pacific Ocean. Whether you're a seasoned pro or just getting started, you'll enjoy the course's well-kept fairways, quick greens, and scenic surroundings. Any golfer visiting the Monterey region should play around at Del Monte Golf Course because of its exciting history and demanding course. Take a scenic hike in Point Lobos State Reserve. The stunning and varied Point Lobos State Reserve is just a short drive from Monterey. Point Lobos is a haven for nature lovers. Thanks to its magnificent cliffs, immaculate beaches, and various fauna, hiking paths take tourists through breathtaking cliffs, coves, unspoiled beaches, and picturesque cypress tree groves. During the journey, visitors can see diverse wildlife such as sea lions, harbor seals, and other bird species. Point Lobo State Reserve is a must-see for anybody traveling through the Monterey area because of its breathtaking natural beauty and fascinating history. Point Lobos offers something to everyone, whether searching for a quiet trek, a beautiful place to have a picnic, or just an opportunity to be close to nature. Visit the historic adobes of California's old Spanish capital, at the San Carlos Cathedral and the Custom House. The Custom House and San Carlos Cathedral are two well-known structures in the center of Monterey. The San Carlos Church, constructed in the 1770 and the oldest continuously operating cathedral in California, serves as a reminder of the region's rich heritage and culture. The Custom House, the most senior government structure in California, was constructed in 1827 and served as the state seat of the Mexican government both structures are now museums, displaying the legacy and history of Monterey and the surrounding area. Visitors can take tours of these historical sites and discover Monterey's rich past and how it influenced California's development. San Carlos Cathedral and the Custom House are must-see locations because of their beautiful architecture and historical significance. And that's it for our tour of the best things to do in Monterey, California. Whether you're a nature lover, a history buff, are simply looking for a relaxing escape. Monterey has something to offer for everyone. Monterey is truly a special place with its stunning coastline, rich cultural heritage, and abundance of outdoor activities. So if you're planning a trip to this beautiful coastal city, add these must-see attractions to your itinerary. Would you take a stroll in Cannery Row or a scenic drive along 17 Mile Drive? Share in the comments below. We are Travel Pug, your guide and forever travel buddy. If you enjoyed and loved this video, hit that like button, subscribe, and hit that notification bell to stay updated on all of our upcoming videos. Thanks for watching. Bye!